Hello everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how to add MailerLite to your Wix website. Now there's two ways of doing this. The first one is that we can make it come up with a pop-up when you first go onto the website. So for example, uh, with uh, Emma Luna Author, uh, when you scroll down for a page you'll get a nice little pop-up. And the other way is that you can kind of add a widget to your website as well and you can bring up on there. So I'll just show you how to do that. So in order to get the newsletter pop up, we need to go to MailerLite and we're going to click on Forms. And then if you want to create one, you can click on Create Form. I'll just go over it very briefly. We're going to click on there and you can give it whatever name you want. It's going to be pop up, go to Save and Continue and then select your subscriber groups. And then once you've done that, click on Continue. And then you get many, many templates on how to create a newsletter template so that people can subscribe. So once you've done all that we're going to go back to forms and we're going to go to overview. Okay I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to click on copy for the JavaScript tracking snippet. So I'm going to click, yeah, just click on copy and then we're going to go back to Wix. So uh, when you get to this stage if you've got a few different uh, sites just make sure you select the one that you actually want the pop-up for. So I'm just going to do that. I'm going to click on it okay and then we're going to click on settings okay we're going to scroll down till we get to the advanced section i'm going to click on custom code i've already applied it for the uh, top part of the website so it pops up uh, but you can put it wherever you want i'm going to click on add code and we're going to paste that snippet that we did and then you can choose what pages you want it to come up on, like if you want it on the first page or if it to pop up on every page. Uh, you can choose all of that and then we're going to click on apply. And then when we go to the website and you start scrolling down, it's going to appear with that lovely pop up, which is really, really handy. Um, so the other way is for, uh, you know, creating a widget on the website essentially. So I'll just show you how to do this one as well. So to create this widget, we need to click on Sites on the left-hand side. And as before, we're going to click on Create. Give it a name and make sure it's got landing page and then Save and Continue. Add whatever you want for your subscribers. Uh, do your template. And once you've done that, we're going to go back to Sites. We're going to click on Overview. And then we're going to click on preview and then at the top left we're going to copy that url okay so we're going to go back to wix and we're going to go to your website page where we can do some edits so i've got a spare screen here just to make things nice and easy so we're going to go to add elements and we're going to go to embedded code and then embedded html so i'm going to click on that and then we're going to click on website address paste what we just copied and click on apply and admittedly it is uh, quite big this it's a little bit too big admittedly but you can make it what size you want but I want people that come onto the website to be able to view it quite nicely uh, then we can just double check the mobile version as well but that's how you do it anyway that's how you create the pop-up to appear when new people come to the website and how to create a widget uh, on the website itself so people can sign up to your newsletter. Okay, thanks very much for watching everyone. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and if you hated it, subscribe. Okay, thanks very much everyone. See you later.